and welcome back everyone to Steel Division 2 with another game, this time Lieutenant Marty, a squire in the kingdom, versus Omer, a knight in the kingdom. We see this battle as they are playing 5th Gebers in the blue side versus 3rd US Armored on this map. Can't remember the name right now, but it doesn't matter. Marty is playing on the Maverick Income and Omer is playing on a <clears throat> Balance Income. So, Basically, um, Marty will have to excuse the noise. Marty will have to use a lot of aggression because if he lets Homer get back to um, get into uh, an advantage there in phase B, it's going to be all over. Third US is super strong, even if some people don't want to admit it. Um, they have really, really strong airplanes there with 2K bombs right off the start. Look at that. Ooh, instant delete and then you just come in with the half tracks with the m8 recon with the m5 and you just you know you literally take out everything so it's gonna be a really hard battle for marty he's still holding on with the poop shen and the stump pioneers but it's not gonna last a long time um over here homer is not doing a lot of work in the middle but you know he does have m15 aa does have uh, 76 uh were these guys called um what are these guys called i, I can't remember the nickname it doesn't matter there's <laughs> homer has even forgotten to unload his infantry that's just how much concentrated he is on this push right here and this one right here but <clears throat> it looks like marty is actually getting the 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 upper the upper game here as he captures all of that, it is 14-10 for Homer nonetheless because Homer actually captures all of that. So a really weird front line that will stabilize itself soon. There is some, you know, infantry coming in over here. Uh, I think Omer will probably relocate into the town maybe, I don't know. But he really needs to open up some infantry um, for the front line to take back uh, its glory. Anyway, 13-11 for Marty right now. Uh, and and Marty has lost everything here. It's going to be super hard for him to get back. He's coming in with a Stug M42 and some Gebers Jaggers. Uh, hopefully, they'll be able to do something. There's some M5 coming in to support in the middle. Good choice, I think. And uh, yeah, indeed. So, Omer did relocate around here, uh, which is the right choice to do because you captured back two flags. Uh, over here, Homer is still fighting strong. Thanks to the help of the M5, that will be destroyed soon. Doesn't even see it. Oh, first shot, first kill from the behind. And <laughs> there you go. The front line, though, is starting to collapse again as Omer is not bringing in more reinforcement around here. He should. Maybe he's going to bring the half track all the way over here just to protect. But here he's uh, actually bringing a couple of infantry. Now, these infantry are really strong. They have the M1 Garan, uh, really, really strong weapon. Plus, they have some M1 Carbine, plus the bazookas, making uh, the American infantry all powerful. But they're not going to last long on their own. Uh, Homer is going to retreat there, try to conserve his infantry. He's got three light tank coming in. They're probably not going to destroy the Stug M42, um, but they could. 50 mil... And they do 70 mil penetration. They could. They could definitely could. Over here, Marty is uh, creating a line, a front line. Both of these guys die to each other. Now, uh, Omer is going to be able to move in with the armor support. All right. M8 still going rampant behind there. There's uh, infantry coming in. The front line has stabilized. It is now 12-12 for Omer and Marty. Which is not a good sign for Marty because this is... He is playing on the Maverick Income. But, you know, Maverick Income will go all the way into Phase B. But generally, by A phase, you really want to have... An advantage over your opponent which you know Omer does have uh, currently and not Marty so so it's not looking that great uh, he captures three flags but even with these three flags there to his name it is still just 1311 for uh, for Omer as Marty captured this flag here 
and will temporarily well he'll get back this real soon as he encircle the enemy m8 will cause a lot of problems here they will uh, destroy any infantry trying to get back so it would be a good idea for homer to for homer to actually bring some reinforcement here maybe uh 80 infantry combo i don't know there's a sniper here sniper bazooka combo with uh, the gebel's uh leader which is really strong flamethrower will die no actually he's gonna get back uh well He'll die soon for sure. Oh, this guy's on return fire, unfortunately. So, yeah. Oh, there you go. Okay. So, Homer saw that. He's going to be shooting at it. Sh wasting his M M MG ammo on the BF-109. BF-109 is going to just circle around. Because he lost line of sight, probably. Will Marty bring up his leader to destroy that? It's it's a weird choice to use the leader as frontline infantry. He's definitely using them for the sniper-bazooka combo. Um, but it would probably be doing good to bring some infantry along uh, just to profit from that uh, leader. Anyway, P-51 coming in for these. Oof, that's going to kill them outright. No, doesn't, doesn't, but I was a bit out of line. Marty slowly but surely coming up. He's going to be bringing the recon with some poopshen. It is currently 1410 for Marty as he uh, recaptures all of this. He captures uh, a lot of the town. Stug M42 versus M15. Yeah, that was obvious. But there you go. The M5 is going to get a side shot. Doesn't outright kill, even though it should have with the 70 with the 70 mil penetration. But there you go. Now he kills it. Gets shot from uh, the Pushan and dies. There's still a Jumbo here. I believe the Jumbo could... Oh, there you go. The age, the duck is gonna shoot and is going to... Oh, so close. So close. Uh, it's a good thing Homer put the Jumbo on return fire because these machine gun firing at the airplane, this is such an annoyance. It's a waste of ammo. It... Tells the opponent where your tank is. I mean, it's really not helping at all. I think this implementation in the game was such a mistake from Eugen. It's just, it's not a feature. No one, no one has for that feature. And it's just, it doesn't do anything. I remember when they started rolling out this patch, uh, airplanes would, would get suppressed by all the aftracks and it would be too powerful. And then they reduce their power, and now it's just completely useless, and it's an hindrance. It's a major hindrance on on yourself. So I think we should all ask Eugen to uh, please remove this useless and dumb feature. Notice how Homer, uh, he will micro his aftrack just enough for his infantry not to die. And, and you got all of these guys shooting at the uh, at this plane, doing absolutely zero damage. There's off map coming in the distance. There you go. Kills the aftrack. Now finally there's some sort of, uh, oh there you go, the AA coming in. And there you go, the airplanes are just going to strafe and kill everything they can. This uh, M15 AA is not the strongest AA. It, it can be very strong with the 37 mil, but most often it'll just, uh, I don't know. I don't find it a very strong choice. It is certainly, uh, <laughs> as I say that, he kills it. Okay, M15 is strong. All right, I'll just stop. But yeah, it's a very mobile AA, but I, I I think it's weak overall. It doesn't have a lot of armor. Uh, you know, you really got to be careful with these guys. Oh, 
there you go. He spotted a plane, I think. Well, anyway. Yeah, there's one over there. more reinforcement here so marty was never able to take care of of this but now we are in b phase and uh it is 14 10 for marty so marty is definitely where he wants to be and all he needs to do is keep pushing option dies um <clears throat> maybe a bit too earlier for pushing Ah, uh, well, there you go. It gets the help from the Jumbo. Now, half-track infantry coming in to profit from this off-map. There was only really three or four units in here. It's, it, it's not a big thing, but still it allows him to move um, in relative safety. P-51 kills this, herning back the flag back to Omer. Over here, a little bit of infantry is going to come in, but uh, this, this dude is definitely going to kill the engineers. Uh, maybe there's going to be another plane to take care of this. Uh, definitely, this uh, rifle could just walk over here and kill it. All right, Homer has captured back this flag, 1311. Now he's going to go uh, for this flag. He's going to have these guys at the ready, I think. He's going to leave the engineer here. To fend for themselves. Over here, Marty is making some significant progress. I mean, it, it is slow, uh, but every inch counts in in a situation like that where the enemy could have had time to really, really reinforce everything. He's gonna be maneuvering these guys really well. There you go, bazooka on the half track. Now he's gonna move back his infantry. These are three star. And the Gabir's uh, infantry, they have exceptional stealth. So they can really hide. They can hide really, really, really well in pretty much everywhere. There you go. Engineer gets a uh, good kill. Going to bring the M8 actually to destroy that. Uh, I think for speed because um, Omer wants to hurry up, I guess. But I think I would have walked the, the arms rifle over here. Of course, though, you don't know how many units are here. Um, there you go. There you go. Side shot. Oh, he should he should be retreating. Dead. There you go. The infantry would have done the job. All right, there you go. So he did bring out these guys to take advantage of the suppression. Stug's gonna kill the half track. This guy might die. Oh, okay. Unloads in time, but the flag thirty eight is gonna do a lot of damage. Uh, but maybe the infantry will get the, the, the better of them. Yeah, he's going to move out. These guys are now not suppressed anymore. But there's only one health left in this unit. Uh, the duck was able to kill some things or put these guys into suppression. Three star Gabriel Skaggers are not going to have difficulty to kill the engineer. But the engineer still throws the TNT and gets this guy. Uh, into a lot of uh, a, a world of pain anyway 60 mil mortars are gonna do some damage there there's some more half tracks uh, with the browning automatic rifle infantry there's some of these 105 gibbers uh, infantry that's gonna be really annoying they are shooting at the m4a3 though i just wonder how useful this is gonna be especially at that distance although they they do have radio capacity i guess but uh, that one was way off i wonder if they're, they're getting to that point. Nah, they're way off. They're way off. Come on, Homer. Walk your dude over. It's safe to do so. Jumbo still kicking it. Ah, that's more like it. Oh, 
Over here, big battle, but the 60 mil mortars combined with the half track will make uh, Marty's job really, really hard. 1311 for Marty, though, still kicking strong. Still got five, uh, si uh, four minutes of, uh, of income advantage, but then it's all over, and Marty doesn't have that big of an advantage. He still need to hold on for 20 minutes at this rate. I guess I was on mute for a little bit. <laughs> okay, Jumbo gets one of the kill. Oh, there he goes, gonna die now. Not even! Oh, wow, lucky, lucky, but could die now from the side shot. Oh, but he missed. Two stars, two three. At 700 meters, actually misses the shot. Uh, that was hard. Hard to watch. These jumbos, what's the side armor? 90 millimeter side armor. It is still pretty decent. I mean, it's better than the Tiger, if I'm not mistaken. Over here, still the same thing. Uh, Omer's not going to go for these lands. There's a M12 GMC 155 mil. And what is that? I've never seen this before. Really? I don't think I ever remember seeing this in the tab, but it's certainly interesting. Uh, radio on tracks. I mean, this is unkillable. You cannot kill that if the enemy moves. Anyway, Stug's going to... Oh, he's fighting against the Jumbo, so he's probably going to lose. But that Jumbo presented his side armor for the third or fourth time and now actually dies. Uh, Omer doesn't have a lot over here. There's uh, 76 coming in. Omer lost everything here. 59 for Marty. Very good job. Uh, this, uh, uh, despite the, the constant mortar barrage and the half track, he was able to push in with the infantry. He did get the poopshin in action. And this is the ideal environment for the poopshin. So really good on uh, Marty. Uh, more artillery is coming in on these, uh, on these guys. They are being counter-fired upon, but it is going to take a while to kill these guys. But it doesn't look like a single shell has landed here. I think he just started. He just started to counter these guys. Um, he can't let them build up too much of his, in, of his artillery or else for sure it's going to be over. We are now entering phase C. Homer is going to get the income advantage. And how, ma how many off-map does Homer have? Jesus. All right. When will he fire? Okay, there you go. 
shot his first round. He needs a direct hit to really do some good damage. There's another round coming in right here. I don't know if you see it. Come on, direct hit. Nah, does a does enough suppression, but uh, anyway, Stug died from the 76. This was expected. 76 are going at 130 millimeter penetration, 90 millimeter uh, armor, and uh, also they are American tanks, so they will not lose. Um, they do not lose accuracy while moving, so that's something to consider. The duck is trying for the 76, and there is well, there's the M15. Will it be enough to stop it? Uh, yeah, it looks like it. Barely, though. That was a close one. Close one. Just constant off map, but it doesn't look like it's paying off for Homer. Uh, he's been trying to take advantage of these off map, but uh, it's not been working out really great. Heat round. Misses. Kills. Now might go out of the uh, off map range. No, he's going to stay there and shoot at the M15 AA. Kills it. Now he's going to move out of the range. Still get shot a little bit. Man, I can't believe with all these off-map, Homer was not able to advance further. But these guys, they are pretty expensive. 140 points. So Homer had really... He needed to cut corners in order to get all of these off map now he's launching these off map but he doesn't have anything to actually you know take advantage of it so a little bit useless i think he's leaving his infantry here to kill any reinforcement coming in there but uh, in fact there's no reinforcement coming because omer is not really pushing around here he's not creating a uh, good enough risk for marty to start bringing stuff uh, this guy is out of ammo, so now Homer has to spend 40 bucks. They had, um, they only have 10 shells. So, I mean, it's a good unit, but 10 shells is really not uh, great. P51 kills the Gebels Jaggers here. There's another one being called right away. Airplane dying. More P-51 coming in. Uh, I'm going to go for the Pack 40 17-7 for Homer. 3 minutes 42 seconds. Oh boy. The SPW AB-41. Really annoying. Really annoying. Um, off map coming in here. Not going to stop this guy from moving in. But these guys will definitely be able to defend against. Now you see how even the infantry in that building was not able to see the Gebers Jäger before he started shooting. So uh, this is just how good the stealth of these infantry are. It's it's impossible for Omer to see anything. And uh, that's going to cause him to lose now. And uh, I believe this is game. 58 seconds, unless Omer does something incredibly badass. Now he's going to lose his jumbo to the duck. Actually, he survives, but maybe this heat round? No, heat rounds misses. Oh, wow. There's too many, too many stuff. And uh, these, these Gebers Jaegers, they're 25 points. Remember when the division first came in? They were 20 points. And I remember that one player would abuse... It was Yuyu. He would abuse this division. Like, that's the only thing he would play. And... Um, but at 25 points, they're a bit more expensive, but... Wow, I guess there's still very strong division. In QP, at least. Um, I had my fair share of one, of win with the uh, 5th Gebers, which is why I, I took it in the tournament against Attack Power. But uh, I don't know. I I lost really bad. So, uh, yeah. Good game to Lieutenant Marty. This is the game where he is seeing his promotion. He's going to be, to be promoted 
to a knight. Uh, he doesn't know that yet, but beating Omer while Homer is using third US is uh, not a small feat. And Lieutenant Marty has become stronger and stronger. And um, yeah, so congratulations, Marty. You're being promoted to the knight rank. And uh, 25 to 18. Wow, 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 wow. P51 did get a lot of kills. M8 as well. Jumbo as well. You know, three stug for a jumbo. That's pretty good my opinion but uh, overall not a lot of kills not a lot of kills compared to lieutenant marty um stug m42 did see a lot of good action gibbers jaggers as well over here and not a uh not a lot of his units did did that well i mean but but he does have a lot of them that kill at least one unit Anyway, everyone, I hope you've enjoyed this and I will see you for next video sometime later. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.